And I'll bet you thought things couldn't get any more exciting in this sports cast, right? Wrong, because it's time for the top plays of the week. Backroom, do your best Aerosmith impression and just push play. This is News 9's Top 5 High School Plays of the Week, sponsored by Cloverbelt Credit Union. We got us a heap of help in a postseason plays this week. Number 5, she's the Panthers' all-time leading scorer for a reason. Leah Ernest, you can't guard me. Rises up for the triple. Number 4, boys basketball, D.C. Everest Landon Mezzi executes the theft and gets away with it, too. The only thing that could have made that better was if we could have watched that hair bounce in slow-mo. For number 3, the forecast predicted a 100% chance of a storm, and it was right. Right. CW Storm's McKenna Caxer gets the pass on the move, and as quick as a lightning strike, she's got a goal. Now it's only fitting that number two goes to a two-time state champion. Medford's Jake Rao went into Madison this weekend looking to defend his crown as the 220-pound champ, and he did just that with authority. He gets the pin in the championship match to end his high school career on top. And the only thing that could beat out a state champion for the top play? A comeback for the ages. Down two with nine minutes left in the final period in the sectional final, the Northland Pines Eagles orchestrated a three-goal masterpiece conducted by Riley McGee, Max Brown, and Zachary Maylett to pull off the win, claim the section title, secure their ticket to state, and of course, become our top play of the week.